Baird starting alongside James Ryan, the very experienced but still very young James Ryan at 24 years of age. Baird and Ryan starting together for the first time in Leinster's second row today. Benedon making Advantage the tackles the as tackle. the referee Two. calls it back. You could have pulled out that. Could have pulled out as the referee to Hamifaiva. First kick of the evening, and it's come back in beautifully from the boots of Ross Byrne and Lencer of the perfect start, but two and a half minutes gone, they lead it by three points to nil. Crouch! Clarkson, Tracy and Byrne in the front row for Leinster. Set! Shrill blast on the whistle. Straight to your knees against Pasquale, second penalty. Never in doubt from the moment he struck it. Over it goes, Leinster lead it by six points to three. Tracy with the throw into the line out and it's taken by Bird. And now it's Leinster's turn to go to the mall and it's in the arms of Tracy Gibson Park. Continues to push his hooker forward and then uses his body weight to try and get him there. And they have got there. Leinster crash over after nearly 19 minutes and is it Tracy who eventually gets up with the ball we will see and confirm it now got a little bit of momentum then Gibson Park saw the opportunity got in front of it. it is James Tracy who holds on and crashes over and Leinster of their first try Halafihi will pick and go and run into it combination of tacklers including Connors but Duvenage has the ball once more and then it's taken on by Morisi who carries it back to that five meter line Garbisi tries to go outside Release. on his own Wait low up. tries to strip the ball should still be there for Benetton advantage being played once more to the Italian side Duvenage looks both ways free play for them Negri they've got there Benetton on their own five meter line as we head towards the final three minutes of this first half. Duvenage scraps the kick away. Henshaw fires it to James Lowe looking for a weakness maybe in that defensive line and back on the angle comes Hugo Keenan. Tackles are good. Benetton try to Mall. turn the ball into a mall. And uh, that tackle, and I think they've done it, and now Leinster, well, they have secured possession. Gibson Park, low, little gap there, James Lowe. Over he goes. <laughs> Terrific finish from Lowe. <laughs> Gibson Park just drew the tackle. Faiva stood off him, and there was nothing really that Garbisi could do. Lowe, lovely feet, just there. Some of the backs in the line out the for Benetton. That's fine, that was well timed. And it's taken well, and Faiva is at the back, the back of the second oh. surge of Benetton bodies going at that line. And has he got there? He has. So well executed by Benetton. Set. Last night. <laughs> Dubinaj eventually gets to feed. And Halafihi has to pick and go. But the front row of oh, Benetton stood up under the pressure of Leinster. Gibson Park eventually gets the ball in for Leinster. Kona controls it. That's really good from the Leinster scrum. They're almost there. Can they dot it down? Try scored, says the referee. Does Conan knock it forward there? Yeah, he does knock it on. I think okay, he does. So it's going to be a penalty try because they opted out in the contest. He's knocked it on there before he scored the try. But they pushed you forward, you've stepped wrong, prevented them from, from going. So well, no try from Jack Conan or indeed Ryan Baird, but there is a penalty try. And the full seven for the dominance of Leinster in that last scrum. The ball is kicked over the top and Henshaw 
Martin gathers it. Will he leave it? Caught in the air. It looked like he was, but the referee is happy to let it go. And Cronin releases Keenan. And Keenan is terrific interplay from Leinster. It was Luke McGrath who was on his shoulder. Keenan Healy's going to play scrum half. It needs to be quick. Eventually, it gets to Ruddock. Tackle from Quaglio. Advantage being played to Leinster. Ringrose will have a little dink and maybe a go. And he ran into his shoulder. 17. Up go the flags. And it's an additional three. Big pressure on young shoulders. Outside of 15. Accurate to stain. Lots of bodies arrive and they stay on their feet. Thank you. Lucchese has it. Lenser do so well to get That's back and stop the first effort, but the hooker has burst free and has scored. Use McGrath it. will be told to use it, and he does. Nope. Henshaw. Great feat to get around the first tackle and keep the momentum going. Here's Reese Ruddock, and he runs into Marco Zanon. Straightened by Clarkson. McGrath has a little look for the ball. Around the corner comes Cronin. McGrath again. Clarkson once more. Good carry from the young man. McGrath almost squirted his way through. Clarkson again. Third time he's handled in this passage of play. Lencer battering around the fringes now. Maloney will pick and go and see if he can find a tired no body arms. defensively. No arms. 17. No arms that means advantage to Leinster. No arm tackle from Benelin defensively. No arms. 17. 20 offside. Quaglio is penalised for no arms. Leinster On the look line. to finish On the line. this game. On the line. 17. Another pick. Another go. Another tackle. But not enough. On the Lencer are over once more. Zanon is put down. Halafihi tries to dance inside James Ryan, who held on and put the number eight to ground. Ioanni takes it at pace, but knocks it forward. And knock on Henshaw sees it out, and that is that at the Stadio Meningo. It's a win for Leinster and nothing to show for Benetton. On a final score of Benetton Trefizo 25, Leinster 37.